Hi, this is Amy and I want to show you how to use the new annotation feature in Google Classroom that just came out yesterday as of the recording of this video. So we're going to go into our Classroom app. We're going to open a class where we have an assignment turned in. This is on the iPad, by the way. And we're going to look at this assignment. So. We may have an assignment here called Testing Annotation. I'm going to tap on Student Work, and now I'm going to open up Tracy's work. So here's Tracy's work. You can see when I go to Jamie, we've already tried it a couple of times on her work, so we'll try it on Tracy's. When we tap on the Google Doc, it's not going to automatically just open up inside Google Drive we're going to see it open inside classroom and we're going to click the pin icon in the top right. Now this pin icon has some options. We can choose the color. So we'll pick green. We can choose the style if we want. So we can have a pin or uh, this is a highlighter. Um, so we can make some choices. We can type and this icon is going to let us, I guess, draw. I don't know yet. Alright, let me try this. So I can say, oh, that's kind of thin. Let me make it a little thicker. I can say, great job. <clears throat> and leave her a little message. And now I can save it with the save icon in the top right. And it's going to save as a PDF. And then it's going to be there visible inside classroom to me and to Tracy. So now I can return her work with the icon in the top right and I can click return if I want. So if this is something I want her to continue working on and editing, I don't need to give her a grade. I can just return it and she'll be able to see those comments. It's pretty cool. I hope you enjoy it. Have a great day. Bye-bye.